someone asks me like a job related question like what's the best thing you've done so far what's been like a highlight of your career so far or anything like that anything highlight related I always have like a few things at the top of my head that have been like standouts but I think from today on today is gonna be the answer to that highlight question because I'm just so excited I can't even talk and I couldn't even sleep last night. <laughs> Try and get a sentence out because the excitement levels are too high. I'm in Paris right now with YSL and today I am going to the YSL lipstick factory. Oh my gosh, like this is a dream come true. I've had dreams about this and last night I was like a kid going to Legoland or something like I kept checking my phone being like is it time to wake up yet? Is it time to wake up yet? It's here. The day has come. So I'm going to take you guys along because I had to share this. One of the reasons today is happening is because you guys watch my videos. And if going to the YSL Lipstick Factory excites me this much, hopefully it will it'll excite you as well. The struggle of the day is, especially for me because I'm a YSL Lipstick fan in capital letters, is what YSL lipstick do you wear to the YSL Lipstick Factory? That is the struggle, okay people? Obviously I'm wearing like a YSL face today in support and excitement. What else is on my face? Let me move my phone. My giant phone. I have the new YSL foundation which I'm going to tell you guys about soon because I love it. I narrowed down to these three lipsticks, okay? <laughs> and I went with this one which is number 44. But I think I might just put all three in my bag and switch it up throughout the day. <laughs> I'm, I'm not joking. You probably think I'm joking. And then I have YSL Black Opium. I'm going to take that in my bag as well. The YSL Mascara and YSL Touche Clap lipsticks are all going in my bag. And my mini Black Opium. It's a little bit dark, but I wanted to show you guys my outfit of the day because I've had this outfit planned for a while <laughs> since this was confirmed. I was like, I know what accessories I'll be wearing. So I'm wearing this drape top, which is from ASOS. I bought it maybe about a week ago, so I'll link it below if I can still find it. It has like... It goes a bit like that sometimes, but <laughs> I'm just covering up here. <laughs> and then I have my BLK denim jeans, which I need to buy a new pair of because these used to be black and I've worn them so much that they're grey. And then I have my YSL shoes, fringing on them, and my YSL bag. I'm going to take my coat and let's go! I am so excited! <laughs> But look, uh, well you probably can't even tell, but it is like pouring with rain, pouring with rain. I'm here with Holly, who's taking me around today. And look at my smile, I need to like play it a bit cooler, don't I? I need to like, I need to be a bit more composed today. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna go for brunch with everyone. And then I think we're gonna all chat about the new products coming out from YSL, because they have some new lipstick launches. And then go to the factory, which is apparently like an hour and a half away outside Paris. So the lowdown is that we're going north to the French fields <laughs> to go to the Rouge de la Chine factory. So I got mine out before I'm wearing today. But today is the time where they make shade number 16, which is like this gorgeous orange color. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna be like clutching this in my hand. Like this is my real one. just got to the factory. I'm gonna have a little presentation now about the Rouge Villap Shine and then head in and see how everything's made. Do I have chocolate in my teeth? I think I do. I just had a chocolate finger. Apparently one of these is sold every 10 seconds worldwide. Wow, 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 wow. The Rouge Pure Couture, oh, <laughs> and this one is the Rouge Volip Shine. So no if you plunge your finger and grip it or whatever in there, you're gonna see oh that the God. texture is very, very, yeah. is Can very I different. Really? We are using pigments. Ooh. So these are pure. Red oh my God, pigments. that feels so okay. weird. This is happening. Give you a machine. 
making little lipstick magic. So apparently Rouge Volupshine is in this vessel. So we have to go and have a look and see inside. This is so unreal. My turn. Let's see. Oh my gosh. Look at that guys. It's amazing. Can you take a picture? That's amazing. Okay, I'm going down. So from that giant tub there, they take a little control bit so they can test the formula out and see that it's doing well. So now he puts the little tester into the lipstick tube and sends it off for like color, pigmentation. Oh my gosh, so look at this. The lipsticks are gonna come out. Oh my gosh, they're not. Look at this, guys. Wow! Perfect bullets. <laughs> So basically with the Rouge Villap shines they inject the formula in the bottom and then it goes all the way through rather than what you saw before which was putting the stick in the actual bullet. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Wow! 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 Exciting because this is where you see like the lipsticks in the bullet just doing their thing on this little mover, like conveyor belt almost. It's so cool. So, this is where the lipsticks get rejected, the reject one. So, she has a little button down there and she'll check all of them here to make sure they're all perfect. Because each shade of the lipstick matches with the shade in the middle, they do different shades on different days. So today is the shade which I think is number 16 and it is so beautiful just looking at all the gorgeous, gorgeous lipsticks in their shiny new packaging. Here they all go. This is where they're all off. And then I think they get put into boxes here. Is that correct? Yeah, oh my god. Look at that guys, they're all being put little boxes right there can you see the gold boxes this is the lipsticks and that right there right there is where they get put into the boxes it's crazy isn't it then they come out here and they're in the plastic as well so you've just seen the full for 360 from pigment to lipstick which is unbelievable look at all of them all of the little babies Everywhere I sell counter, every lipstick is made right here. And these are the boxes that they arrive in. Whoa, my, my mind's just blown. It's all around us. Technically, it's Shrove Tuesday today, which means it's a pancake day. So Holly and I have come for crepes on the corner of the hotel and I'm speaking so fast because they smell so, 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 so good. I just got a really nice one with lemon and I think Holly got hers with brown sugar as well. So I'm tucking in. Bye. So we can swim oceans, never swim. It's only been like 50 seconds. I literally inhaled my crab. It was so good. Got a bit caught in the rain, but I made it to Estee's room. Hello. <laughs> Party. <laughs> We've just been eating crisps. Yep. The evidence, as you do. Having a chat. I even shed a tear. Why did I cry? I'm so emotional. Like it's not even funny. I think it was it was something nice and cute. So don't stress yourself out. So it's fine. Um, and now I think we're gonna head downstairs for a little. I need to freshen up a little bit. But we're gonna head downstairs for some dinner and drinks. Woo! You notice that the floors in here are. Yes, I know. <laughs> I know. I walked in the bathroom and I was like. These floors are nice. Yeah, I was like, mm. <laughs> but then the one in the toilet. I know, isn't it's not. <laughs> yeah. So I was like, oh. <laughs> another cold day in Paris but at least the sun is out because okay. well I don't really need to explain why I do <laughs> anyway we're going in the cab we're gonna go and have the YSL product hangouts and apparently we get to see all the new products leading up till September oh 
So this is the new foundation, which I've already been wearing, and then they just told us about this new cushion foundation, which I'm gonna try and open if I'm allowed. There we go. It's the Fusion Ink foundation in a cushion format. Let me just close that properly. And then, also this brush which has a Y in it. There it is, that way. So this is the foundation brush that goes with the new foundation. They've also brought out three limited edition Touche Claire and this one, I don't know if you can see that, but it says I am not a morning person. There are two more in the limited edition collection. The other ones are No Need to Sleep and All Lights on Me, but I think this one's my favourite because I'm actually not a morning person. Okay, we are leaving the foundation room and going to the best room, in my opinion, which is the lipstick room. Wow, this looks amazing. My favourite lipsticks. Oh look, we can see the shades. remember the last time I vlogged I think it was a YSL today which was really nice I hope you guys enjoyed seeing a little sneak peek of all the new launches normally brands like embargo the new launches but YSL being very generous and letting up letting me share all the little sneak peeks for everything new coming up but I'm a bit dressed up right now I'm a little bit dolled up because I'm going to the YSL beauty night out I thought I would show you my outfit of the night in this very snazzy mirror here I'm wearing this dress from the Jet Set Diaries. I was about to say For Love and Lemons because I'm so used to saying this dress is from For Love and Lemons because I'm always wearing For Love and Lemons. Anyway, I love the Jet Set Diaries as well. It's another brand I buy on Revolve. And look, it has this little lace bit, but it's not like staying up. It's really cute. And it has these kind of drapey shoulders and a really flowy skirt. And if you can see, the skirt has a kind of lace layer underneath. And then I'm wearing my YSL trib shoes. Being the true fangirl that I am, I thought I'd also bring my YSL bag. So I'm like a little YSL groupie <laughs> tonight. My eyes, I have the Charlotte Tilbury Dolce Vita palette and on my lips I have the YSL Rouge Volup Shine in number 47. Mixing it up tonight because I've been wearing 44 this whole week and now I thought I'd wear 47. Oh so we're going baby. to a dinner <laughs> um, to a restaurant called Derriere. Isn't that fun? Yeah, it's fun. <laughs> this is Lucy. <laughs> And she has a great fashion blog called Fashion Me Now, yeah. which I'll link below. <laughs> this is my favourite necklace. Oh, yeah. Do you guys recognise it? It's from her collection. Yeah. Oh, is that one from your and collection this one. Too? And the, Yeah, and this one. I love the bottom yeah. one. Yeah, little so mini nice. fan. I always wear the top one, the <laughs> bang one. Ooh, this is so nice. Pasta. This restaurant is so nice. So this is the menu at Derriere and I wanted to show you guys how it's laid out because I've never seen a menu like this. It, it puts it like this and it puts vegetable and then it basically gives you the definition of a vegetable and then it says seasonal salad and stuff like that. So basically you have like starters on here, other starters there and then where was the bit? Oh yeah, this is the bit we were laughing at, a pasta that looks like an ear in case you didn't know. I'm back in the room now guys and after dinner we went to this YSL beauty night out party which was amazing it was like on two floors with people, packed with alcohol. They even had these really good like chocolate biscuit things. You can always find me by the chocolate eaters at. These ones are really good. Really, really fun evening. And I realized as I was like thinking about my vlog, I was like, oh my gosh, I didn't debrief on the lipstick factory because we went straight from the lipstick factory to crepes to dinner. So I wanted to tell you guys my thoughts on that. My <laughs> thoughts were, if you couldn't tell me acting like a child, was it was just, the most unbelievable experience seeing and being in the place where all the Rouge Volup shines are made world like to ship worldwide basically it was just incredible seeing the process from pigment to packaging it was so 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 cool and I really hope you guys enjoyed seeing it as well now every time I use the lipstick I'm like I know so much more about these and I've just seen it all so hopefully the lipsticks will be more special to you as well now maybe it's past midnight so I'm like mega about to go to bed and fall asleep before I take my makeup off I hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog and thank you so much for YSL for taking me on this amazing trip 
and letting me see the behind the scenes of everything that goes on in the factory. It was like definitely one of the most memorable days ever, ever, ever. This has just been a fantastic trip. They've just like completely, completely spoiled us and I hope you guys enjoyed coming along too and seeing the, what did I call it before? From from pigment to packaging. I thought that was a really cool little, little thing. I just, I made that up. I'm gonna go to bed now. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and I will see you soon. Bye guys. Bye.